what's up so in this video I'm gonna replace my RS19 high torque fan with this fan I don't know anything about this fan somebody recommended this to me yesterday hello this is future Pete and future Pete is telling you this fan is absolutely not worth it it has no power at all. Well, it's great, it's quiet, but it just has no power. So don't even think about this fan. I will cut this part out of the video where I install this fan because it's it's just not worth it. Long story short, I ordered two fans. I ordered these two fans and I'm quite happy with these two fans. And now you will see how I installed these two fans and um, it's supposed to be a short video so let's just jump right into it the reason why i'm replacing this fan is because it's super loud that's how loud it is so to show you the difference between the three fans of noise and power without any special equipment the original godway fan it's powerful but it's noisy the fan i installed you will see here and the new fan which i'm about to install before working on the motherboard unplug the motherboard turn the wheel on until there's no power and now it's kind of safer to work on the wheel so if you have never sold it in your life before i would recommend you to solder something to to just train on it but it's not that hard um so everything i'm doing right now is put red on red and black on black this is the old connection from this really like not old but two days old connection from the really quiet fan which doesn't work because it's not powerful enough now I'm just using a little bit of heat shrink. Put a little bit of solder on this wonderful thingy. It's probably not the best case to solder on, on the battery. Just That's it. Then put the heat shrink down. And if you don't have a lighter, you don't need a lighter to shrink the heat shrink. So that's it. Actually, really, really fast and easy thing. Now I'm just wondering if I should bring it in or out. I think I should blow air on the motherboard before I thought I should just pull it away. But the fan is not pulling air, it's just like pushing the air in front and not pulling from behind. So and I left the wire long enough to be able to be here or here, so I can decide later on. Of the cables. That's how Godway imagined the fan should be over here. This is like, holy shit, Godway! Like, why? Like. Come on, bitches. Fuck, man. 
this wire management it's unbelievable like really why why it's not wire management it's wire unmanagement holy shit So before putting everything back together, I will clean this up. So this is what you get when you get a good way. Like, what should I say? Um, but the performance is great. I love this wheel. It hasn't had cut off in like 2,400 kilometers or so. Um, great wheel. I love it. But it looks like my neighbor built it, or I built it. Um, so yeah, I will turn it on, and then the fan should like move for a second. Yep. Great. Did you see it? I hope you saw it. It worked. It moved. It's kind of stable. Like where 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 should it go? It's not it's not nice how I installed it. It's the good way way. That's my excuse. Um, yeah, I will put it back together, clean it up before, and then I will do another test ride. The little test over here. I'm riding with the high talk in these kind of conditions hilly mountains um, and obviously i want to ride uh, with a little bit of a fan fun factor or you can see it it's quite steep over here sometimes um, i'm at 60 degrees right now i think 60 degrees is a little bit too much um, so i will definitely install a second fan that's 30 it's 30 degrees outside temperature um, and in Germany well uh, let's just say I'm not in Germany right now So, ladies and gentlemen and fan, fans of fans, um, this is the original fan again. Different direction. Powerful and super loud. And this dun, 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 is the new fan I got. Same dimensions um, different engine and you can hear the different engine and you can also feel the different engine yes but it makes wind it makes a noise but it makes, I would say, enough wind and is quite enough to be part of my unicycle. So, so I got two options. You got two options if you do it at home. You can place it here. Then I have two flare fans blowing on the board or I turn it around like a friend of mine did it. He drilled some holes into his uh, cover and blew the air out. And I think that's also a nice idea to just place it here and the wind just blows it out. 
I will go with this for now. Um, just do it with some hot glue. And solder these two wires onto my soldering I did over here. I will just need to open this again. Um, this this fan worked quite well. So, plus is on plus, minus is on minus, um, everything is kind of solid protected. I will plug this in again, turn it on and just hope everything works how it's supposed to work. I hate this loud beep. Yes, yes, both were spinning. Da -da 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 -da. That's nice. So I will just plug this one here, this one here, um, with some hot glue instead of this tape. Oh, fuck you, Godway. That's not fun. Ah, uh, no, I won't complain about the wiring because that's what I bought. Where am I supposed to put the wires? Where? Anyways, I will figure out a solution and we will see. So it's not a big difference if it is here or not. It's it's just these wires which really annoy me. Like why? I I just don't understand why you would produce it like so be careful with fixing this one because one, two, three, four, five, six screws are connecting the pedal hanger you need to unscrew the pedal hanger to get rid of the motor to pull it out so you can't just make a tire change when you glue the fan on so i i would say that's a stupid idea you obviously can glue it on and then cut the glue off again afterwards just want to say be careful so my hot glue is hot glue now, so I will place this thing like this. I cleaned this area with a wet towel, so it's free of dust. And Yeah, they won't go anywhere so now it looks like this this is the end product one fan over here one fan over here and i might do some holes if i need to maybe you remember the beginning of the video It actually faced 
like this is the fan side so it actually faced in the beginning of the video this way So you can hear this restarting, rebooting sound of the fan. I don't know why, but it's cooling. It's way more quiet. And yeah, I'm happy with it. bunch of testing I'm done I would say uh, we got 22 kilometers down I hope you can see the, the stats um, 51 51 degrees we have an outside temperature of still 27 it says maybe it's 25 um, I'm happy with it. I wouldn't say it got better. I wouldn't say it got worse. The only thing that got better is the sound because yeah, I don't know if you can hear the ventilation, but it's it's kind of quiet. It's kind of super quiet. I'm happy with it. Um, it's not this light. It's not this plain engine anymore. And people look at you like what kind of engine is in your wheel um, so it's quiet it's nice I like it um, for a better cooling system I definitely suggest to put the holes inside um, I might do that I'm happy for now um, over 30 degrees I always had problems with the wheel um, I guess that would be similar with this setup as well and yeah, I hope you could learn something in this video and I might do an update.